Hello everyone, and welcome to Classic Scenario Mode. So, Classic Scenario, as I said, Scenario Mode. Hold off the faster cars and finish first. No walk at that. So, we're going to do this first one then. There's just three at the moment. I haven't got the 90s content for now. I will get it soon, so there will be a few more challenges, I'm sure, with the 90s content. We'll start with the 80s stuff then. So, you've been given the 1918s Williams car and been placed second on the grid next to your teammate, Alan Prost. There are faster cars around you, so a good start is important. If you can get ahead of Alan on the first lap, it may allow you to create a gap and finish ahead of the fast cars in the pack. So we'll go once again for gold. And we'll see what we can do. So we've got a slower car then, going to be second on the grid with Alan first. And hope we can get past him. With the cars lined up in reverse order, can the two 1980s Williams drivers hold off the faster cars starting behind them? I hope so. So, Mary Walker there once again. I quite like the inclusion of him, it kind of adds a little something, doesn't it, to the uh, okay, classics. To Let's have uh, on, gone for cockpit this. view. I do prefer it for the classics, at least. I'm not too sure about the uh, modern cars just yet. Shifted a bit early then. Got away with it though. Oh, well done there. Going pretty slow, going to have to go on the outside of him. He touched that. It breaks fairly early. I don't know how much the corner with where I braked. It's definitely one of the slower cars, but I'm a bit more used to Brands Hatch now. Bit wide there. So coming to the fast course now, Mance has already managed to get ahead of uh, Prost. Sounds weird saying that, doesn't it? Like, doesn't it? In a game called F1 2013. Couldn't quite do full foot there, had a bad racing line. Let's see if I can not manage to not cut this corner. No, I still cut the corner. I'm not going to that corner at all yet. To run wide there. So Mansell's closing me down now, 2.1 behind he is. But there's only three laps, so hopefully I can hold him off. So I was a lot faster than him on the start, but I've got a feeling in a minute I'm not going to be. Oh, very wide. Coming to set score now then. Very tight corner, I should nail it quite nicely. Next corner, absolute full throttle easily in any car, I think. I haven't tried a 70s car yet, of course, but. A bit wide there. Managed to hold off Mantua nicely, actually, she's not really gaining on me at the moment. 3.8, I've actually managed to pull out the gap a bit. We'll see if we can do this corner full throttle now then. Not quite, had to ease off a little bit there, but. I'm sure I can possibly manage it next time and see if I can knock cut this corner. I'll manage that as well. That might be full throttle, you know, in this car. I believe it's quite heavily down on power. Not too up my classic stuff, not going to lie. So I think it's quite down on power on the cars behind. But cornering speed, I believe, is pretty much just as good. Seems to be anyway, it feels pretty good. Up two then. Looks like this is going to be fairly easy. Turned in too late, they're going to run wide. Not too bad though. A bit wide there. This car actually feels a bit better though, must be said. It's down on power, but because of that, I presume maybe it isn't a turbo car. Again, like I said, I'm not too clued up on the classics. But um, it's much more intuitive to drive. Feels a bit better. You don't get wheel spin so easy. Which is good. Let's see if we can find this corner full throttle. Yep, easy. Let's see if we can do this next one full throttle as well. No, nowhere near. <laughs> Whoa, just about. Managed to, uh, of course, there's no damage with these classics, but just about managed to not spin it. Too much speed in there, really. Stay in this gear because this corner is this gear. And there we go. 6.9 then. So, again, much better at Brands Hatch then. And there we go. Cross the line then for P1. And there we go. Gained one position, fast slap, one minute, 4.2. And that'll be gold. There we go. The fans here today certainly got their money's worth with a stunning drive from the 1980s Williams that finished first. And there we go. Stunning drive from the 1980s Williams that finished first. I don't believe there's a... Uh, Cutscene for this is there for the classics? No, there isn't. Oh no, there is. Thought there wasn't. There we go. Classic cutscene. Nice 
And there we go. So that's a bit then for this uh, scenario mode of classic cars. So it's one of three for now, and I'm pretty sure there will be six. So we'll do the next one soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.